Natan Obed felt a rush of pride as he watched Mary Simon take the governor general's oath of office. I was so proud, uh, not just for Inuit, but also for First Nations and Métis as well, and all Canadians. But Obed is the president of the Inuit Tapari Kanatami, a position Simon held twice in the early 2000s. He worries the expectations placed on her as the first indigenous head of a colonial state may be too high. But he thinks the veteran diplomat, administrator and politician is up to the task. As somebody who's gone through the constitutional repatriation talks, who's been an Inuk leader for the better part of 40 years, uh, she understands to her core the way in which Canada has um, abused human rights, has, has been a colonial institution. David Chartrand reacted the same way as he watched the new governor general emerge from the Senate. Oh, pride. Uh, I had a chance to tell Mary how proud the Métis Nation is of, of her appointment. Chartrand, vice president for the Métis National Council, praised the appointment and had a message for those criticizing her inability to speak French. What if we told you, you don't speak our indigenous language, you can't come to our country, how would you feel? So I think people should give her the time and she will learn French without doubt. It's just, uh, but in, uh, indigenous language are before French and English in this country. So. Obed called the criticisms disheartening because Simon attended a federal day school in northern Quebec that didn't offer education in French. But for Obed and many others, today was one of hope and optimism. AFN National Chief Roseanne Archibald was in attendance but wasn't available for comment prior to broadcast. Brett Forster, APTN National News, Ottawa.